What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, caps, you sides, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Free general collective reading. This is um, this is psychic intuitive channel messages, so it's very important to only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Uh, one message may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. So it's very important to only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Um, I'm not currently open for personal readings. Um, if I get a huge influx of people requesting personal readings, um, I will open them up. I just want to um, make everybody aware of that as well real quick before we dive into this, okay? Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 13,230 subscribers, so thanks so much for all the love and support. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Row 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. To donate. And for the newbies that have just joined my channel, these are, um, these are free readings. So my free general readings, which are the ones I post on my channel, they're all free to view. You don't pay a dime. I get money on the back end through Google AdSense for, for that, which isn't a whole bunch, but I do get money on the back end when you for the advertising, when you view the channel. But you don't pay a dime for the free readings. However, if you want a personal reading, they're $125 for 20 minutes, just to let everybody know, okay? So you don't pay a dime when you come on my channel and you view the readings, okay? I get money on the back end. Um, like I said, I get money for uh, the donations, and several people have donated recently and in the past, and thanks so much for all the donations, and I get money for the personal readings, but right now the personal readings are not currently open, but if I get a huge influx, I might consider opening them, just to let everybody know, okay? I do pre-recorded uh, readings right now to protect my energy, just to let everybody know. All right, so we're going to get started. All right, so the channel message I received was um, someone is um, someone is about to get offered a job position soon. Um, I heard workspace environment healthcare, but they will be uh, asked to sign a NDA. It will not be a good idea to do this. There's a reason they're wanting to, you to do this. You plug it in, how it resonates. Um, whoever you are and how this applies. You are looking for a job in the healthcare profession in some shape, form, or fashion. You haven't accepted the position yet, whoever you are and how this applies. You haven't accepted it yet. I feel you could be, well, you could be anything in the healthcare profession. CNA, LPN, LVN, RN, CRNP, uh, radiologist, respiratory therapist, um, anesthesiologist. I don't know. The list could go on. Some, some in the health pro healthcare profession in some shape, form, or fashion, whoever you are, sir, ma'am, you're looking for a job. You are currently looking for a job. It hasn't happened yet, but upcoming, they're about to, it sounds like they're going to offer you this position, but to offer you this position, they're going to want you to sign an N, I heard an NDA. Now, I was, I'm fa fairly familiar with the NDA. I've never signed an NDA, never been asked to sign an NDA. Um, well, I have been asked to sign an NDA before, but, um, in a workplace, but I just chose not to, um, take that position on that. So that's, that's the truth. But, um, nay, nay. Um, cause anytime any, an employer asks you to sign an NDA, especially in the medical profession, that's a huge red flag. That's a huge ass red flag. And that's just the truth. I mean, of course you have free will and you can choose to sign this NDA. Um, prospective person looking in this uh, in this healthcare company, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But that's just never a good sign. It just never is. Maybe whoever this is for, I would really highly suggest checking out. I posted it yesterday. It's uh, her name is Nurse Liz. That is her YouTube handle. I posted it yesterday. It's a few videos down on my channel. Uh, she's a nurse too. She's an RN and she's an educator. Um, so she doesn't, she's not afraid to get fired. <laughs> and that's just damn true. She told you on there. Um, I really love her, but, um, she does reviews and one day I'm going to do that shit. And that's just the truth. I love her. That was a wonderful idea. And one day 
I aspire to be like her. I aspire to be like you, ma'am. Just saying, just saying. But anyways, um, I would really highly suggest checking her out. Nurse Liz. It's a, a few videos down. Um, whoever this is for. She talks about a little bit about this in there. In a way. In a way. Roundabout way. Um, if you're interested. She's very knowledgeable. Very knowledgeable. She's a, a, you can just tell by the way she talks, she's a good nurse. She's a really freaking good nurse. She's very selective and picky. Um, good nurses are, and that's just the truth. I mean, you can choose to check her video out or not. I would suggest, I'm just saying. Um, I wonder if you're a new grad, whoever you are. I wonder if you're a new grad. I think you might be a new grad, whoever this is for, or very wet in the medical field whoever you are. Um, but the spiritual download in this is, it wouldn't be smart. And I'm t I don't need a spiritual download to tell you that. It would not be smart. It absolutely not. I have been asked before, uh, like I said, I took that back because I have been asked before to sign an NDA before. I just chose not to take the position. And that's the truth. As much as I would have loved to get my money up at that point, I knew it wouldn't be smart. And that's the truth. So I'm going to read non-disclosure agreement. Um, that way, if you don't know what a non-disclosure agreement is, everybody's on the same page here, okay? It is a contract through which the parties agree not to disclose any information covered by the agreement. A non-disclosure agreement creates a confidential relationship between the parties, typically to protect any type of confidential and proprietary information or trade secrets. As such, an NDA protects non-public business information. Like all contracts, they cannot be forced if this contracted activities are illegal. Okay. I just, okay. So there are like, okay. Hold on a second. It's usually to, um, it protects confidential information basically is what an NDA, NDA is. There's NDAs like Physician, patient privileges, attorney client privileges, priest, penitent privilege, and bank client confidentiality, which those are standard. Those are standard. Um, at least I would hope those are standard. But if an employer, and in this case, a healthcare company, asks you to sign an NDA, that's a huge red flag because why are they asking you? They're basically asking you not to talk about anything in work is what I'm presuming outside of work. Why are they asking you to do that? I mean, I'm just being for real. If anybody needs to hear that. Why? 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 For some, it's a hospital. Huge changes have occurred here. Huge. And they're going to continue to change. For some, it's a long-term care facility. For some, it's a clinic. Okay, so for some, it's a clinic. For some, it's a hospital. And for some, it's a long-term care facility. Huge changes have already occurred here, and they're going to continue to occur. Why are they asking you? Uh, I, oof, that's scary. I have worked many places in my life, many places. Long-term care, hospitals. I've never worked a clinic. I've worked skilled nursing. I've worked um, hospital. Um, and I'm just being for real. And I've worked wellness for the state. Why? And all the places I've worked, I've never signed an NDA. I never have. There's a reason they're asking you to sign this NDA. And it's not to benefit you. You have not been hired in on this, this company, this place yet. Whether it's skilled nursing facility, hospital, or clinic. You need to really ask yourself why they're doing it, and it's not to benefit you. Of course, you have free will and you can choose to sign the NDA or not, but there's a reason I'm getting this channeling, and I think it's because you watch my channel. So, of course, I always say on here, always use your own intuition, logic, and reasoning when making these decisions, okay? I'm just the channeler from the spiritual realm with psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. You have your own free will. I'm not, I'm not here to tell you what to do. You need to make your own decision. But I will tell you from experience as a nurse, being a nurse for a really long time, if it is nursing, that's a huge red flag. 
medical professional, period, that's a huge red flag. And that's just the truth. You can take the advice or leave it, okay? Let me see if I hear anything else. In one of these situations, there's try there's a cover-up here. This would not be a smart place to work. They're going to offer you a sign-on bonus, too. In one of these situations, there's a cover-up going on here, and um, um, they're going to offer you a sign-on bonus, too, and it would not be a smart place to work. So whoever you are, you're going to be asked to off, uh, sign an NDA, a non-disclosure agreement, be offered a sign-on bonus, but there's also a cover-up going on somewhere inside this company or facility or hospital or clinic or something and that's, they're basically luring you in with the sign-on bonus and the, um, and the, in the non-disclosure agreement. Those are huge red flags. Of course, you can take this advice or leave it. I would really suggest watching the Nurse Liz video. Um, if you don't want to hear it from me, I are in and a psychic, listen to the nurse that's not a psychic. Um, and I'm just being for real. If you... Of course, with your free will, if you choose to listen, um, this doesn't sound good. And I'm just being for real, for real. Not all that glitters is gold. If anybody needs to hear that. Several shocking negative tower moments are about to occur with these places very soon. If you sign this, you will regret it. Know this. Several shocking negative power moments are about to occur with these places soon. If you sign this, you will, will regret it. So if you sign this NDA and you acquire the sign-on bonus and you get in there, and I know you're probably, you're probably really, really, whoever you, I feel you might be new grad for some of you. I didn't hear you were, but I feel for some of you might be new grads. If, oh, oh I heard if you sign this and you basically get in on in there, whoever you are, I feel you might need the money. Well, you might need the money or it just seems very enticing. But just let me tell you from a nurse with a lot of freaking experience, this is red flags all over the freaking place, man. It just is. Of course, you have free will and you can do it. But I heard if you do it, if you take the bait, basically, and um, you get in there, there's about to be several negative, huge negative tower moments happening. Somewhere in this, in this clinic, in this um, hospital, or in this um, school nursing facility. Um, and I heard you will regret it. So I think you might get in the middle of a lawsuit. Um, or somebody's going to try to take you down. Um, maybe a secret competition with employee or employees. Or you get into some kind of, or something happens with your patient. And then... Um, there's a medical malpractice lawsuit or you get in a skilled nursing facility and uh, there's a hidden camera in a resident's room and they're building a case and you get yourself involved in that shit. Somebody needs to be careful. Whoever you are, sir, ma'am, you're looking for a job in the medical profession, whoever you are. All right, I'm out of this. Love you guys, I'm going to say.